my YouTube people, how you guys doing? It's me, um, I'm just uh, getting ready to take off in my car. I am heading to a place called Souvenirs de Puerto Rico, which means Souvenirs of Puerto Rico. Uh, it is a store that sells all kinds of uh, related items that are from, actually from Puerto Rico. Uh, the Souvenirs de Puerto Rico is actually about 25 minutes away and it's in Hollywood, Florida. Again, um, heading back to Hollywood, Florida. Well, anyway, before I end up getting uh, taken away and put in a straitjacket uh, because I'm talking to a camera in my car, um, I think I'm going to let you guys go right now and I will be back shortly. See you soon. All right, so I just got here. It's um, down here, down in Hollywood, Florida. Um, I got to this shop and I'm hoping it's open um, because there were no cars in front of the place but this is it I'll show you what it looks like um, for my car I guess and this is it it's a uh, Souvenirs de Puerto Rico as you can see in the window it's just nothing but a lot of souvenirs from Puerto Rico uh, for those of you who've lived in Puerto Rico and have visited Puerto Rico, you will notice that there's a lot of familiar items in this place. Um, but the main reason why I decided to come here was because not only do they have souvenirs, but apparently they have pasteles, which is uh, usually a, something that we eat for the Christmas holidays. Uh, it's traditional. Um, food. Uh, also they have uh, baked breads that are made from Puerto Rico. So I'm going to try to see, I'm going to go in and see if uh, they're open and if not then I will have to come back another time today. Okay people so uh, I went into the place um, and the place is pretty spacious. Um, I would think I was the only one there. Maybe there was two other people there. I don't know if they worked there or they were just because I was the only car out here but um, they had a refrigerator like three or four refrigerators with all kinds of food from Puerto Rico and of course I went in to get uh, my pasteles and I'm walking out with my pasteles these are them right here yeah uh, I'll tell you a little bit more about these uh, when I get home and I start boiling them because that's what's gonna be for dinner tonight. So check it out, baby. I got my pasteles. I'm getting them ready. Got the pack going. Filling it up with some water. Start getting it boiled. We'll throw a little salt. A little sea salt. And uh, we'll get these pasteles going. Check this out. Check it out, baby. That is the pasteles. Boiling away in the hot water, getting nice and hard. All right, looks good. Oh my God, I wish you guys can smell the aroma of the banana leaves. It brings back a lot of good memories. A lot of good memories of my grandma and my family when they were cooking during uh, special occasions. Yeah, so. So this is how it's wrapped. They use this paper here, and then they use the banana leaf. Okay. And I'm going to try to do this with one hand uh, because I'm holding the camera with the other. See, this is it. This is what you call pasteles. It's kind of sticking on pretty good to the banana machine. Hopefully I can get it out without ruining the whole thing. Yeah, it's coming out. Oh, God. That looks good. 
This is it, baby. Now we just flip this onto the actual plate. And there's one right there. You can see there's meat, there's pork, and there's some olives. And usually you eat this with um, arroz con gandules. Um, that's usually the typical way of eating it. And that's it. Yum! I gotta try this. I really have to try this before anything. I really need to try this. Mmm. Oh my god. This brings back so many memories. Mmm. Delicious! Oh my god. That is the bomb! Thank you, Israel, for telling me about this place. I'm gonna definitely be there a lot, a lot more. Um, the pasteles are delicious. Uh, it tastes incredible, and I'll be getting a lot more. Yeah, I'll definitely be going there more often. Yes.